Today we are going to create curved pages for our other application using Entity Framework Core and Database First Approach. So let's have an overview of our database. I have two tables, countries and cities. Inside countries, I have countries. Um, I have four countries, three countries right now. Okay, and here I have some cities which belongs to these countries and have a foreign key for country ID. So what I'm going to do is I'll just create a new project and I'm going to take SPNet Core Web Application next uh, web app resort create tag the template resort pages mm -hmm. select it no HTTPS for now I'm using .NET Core 3.1.4 let's create okay there we go now first thing first let's uh, include some dependencies what i want is i need two new git packages here from the package manager console let's install package microsoft entity framework core dot sql server Let's get this package. The next package we need here is the tool so that we can use our DB context command. Okay, cool. There we go. Now we are ready to create or generate classes for our database tables. For that, let's execute a scaffold DB context connection string output DIR models and uh, tables, both tables. I don't need to mention the tables because we need both tables or all tables right now okay connection is string server equals to dot i'm going to use windows authentication for that trusted connection to true and my database name is test tv uh, okay i forgot to mention the package Microsoft dot entity framework core dot SQL server. Let's wait for the model to be generated. It has started the build and uh, I'm waiting for my models folder to appear over here just below the WW root. Meanwhile, don't forget to subscribe the channel. Okay, there we go. And we have our cities, country, and DB context. Cool. Now it's time to add browser pages. For that, let's first create our folders inside pages. Add new folder, countries. And the next folder I want here is for cities. Mm, but cities is also the name of the class. And let me our cities. Let me give it a name, our cities. Okay, inside countries, let's add the resort page. Curve, add. Okay my model is country and the context is test entities it will fetch required new get packages don't forget to press the bell icon so that you will be keep learning with me i'll be making so many new videos on various topics on pleasure on grpc on signal r so be with me okay there we go our pages are Generated inside countries folder that's good and now let's do the same activity for cities add 
Razor page curve and this time the model will be cities tp contacts will remain same add okay wonderful all our cut pages are generated we are ready to execute the application just one last thing here is remaining is we need to add the service inside a startup we need to add our db context services dot add db context of type models dot test db context and that's it wonderful let's hit execute and let's try our project i have forgot to link the pages from my layout so that's okay for now we will type the name in address bar okay wonderful let's just write the name countries okay good let's duplicate this url and here are cities now we have the list of our cities in third countries we have India, China, USA and my country let me rename it to Pakistan okay there it goes and in third cities uh, if I come to add it there is just one thing it's displaying the ID of countries instead of the name of country so let's correct the functionality first uh, let's stop the project Let's first add our links as well inside layouts. And here, copy the last item. Control C, Control V. Countries our cities cities countries sorry that's good wonderful now what we want here is first of all let's close all this stuff and just come into our countries and inside add it now what we want is we want country name instead of country id from where this data is coming oh, from view back so open the its code file and from here it's uh, putting in the data into view data from here this is on get async so here i want to the value field is id the display field should be country name instead of country id let me confirm the name from database country country name okay good country name and perfect it should work fine now okay uh, let's execute the project once again both things should be corrected i should get the links and top bar there they are country and here okay now the name of country is coming instead of for example if there is some Chinese city I will just provide China now I'm not getting country IDs here I'm getting country ID let's correct this one too inside the index let's open the index from here of cities index of cities and from here instead of country ID dename it to country name that's it it will work perfect now let's execute okay our cities perfect this is what you wanted there should come the name of country instead of country id so that's it for this session thank you very much stay with me you will learn a lot of things thank you